Continue to field questions for us similarly. I have a student from within our Telegram group who's asking, how do you spot experimental questions on the US simile and what do you do about them? So I'll give you a solid answer here. I've made plenty of YouTube clips on this topic already. I don't carry the entitlement that you'll go back through someone's YouTube in 2022, but I'll address this. Experimental questions. What do you need to know? How do you spot them? So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Give the video a like. I really appreciate it. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical. Links down below. Find me on Telegram. Links to Telegram group and channel down below. Now start the clip. So student wants to know about experimental questions, how to spot them. What do you do? I have a solid answer here. So my response to this is, Nobody fucking knows which questions appearing on your real deal are quote unquote the experimental ones. Okay? It's always speculative. Students tend to default into this notion that for whatever fucking reason, the experimental questions are going to be the strange molecular type ones or experiment research type ones. Nobody fucking knows. Okay, it's experimental. U.S. Somalia has not objectively disclosed and said these are the topics we're experimenting with because that would, in a sense, actually defeat the point of experimenting to begin with. So in terms of spotting experimental questions, nobody knows, as I just fucking said. And the other point is it doesn't change your management in any way in terms of how you approach your study. I mean, you're going to study all the high-yield material as you need, independent of any notion of experimental questions appearing. And for everyone taking the exam, uh, things will just cancel out, okay? If there's a weird question, you have no idea what it's about, well, other people are going to feel the same way, all right? So uh, the consolidated point here is you just need to go through UWorld, go through the NBME exams as I've harped on, go through my high yield PDFs, go through my audio cue bank here on the YouTube, I made tons of clips here on my YouTube on the, on the exam guidance playlist, and don't fucking worry about experimental questions. You know the deal to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.